The latest figures released by the Statistical Institute of Belize indicate that the overall number of working persons has grown by at least 3,557 from April 2014. That general improvement is attributed to an increase in the number of women that are employed. The labor force grew a very slightly between April 2014 and 2015 from 151,317 persons in April 2014 to 153,689 persons in April 2015. Males constituted 63% of the labor force and females 39% at those numbers. Across the country, the Orange Walk and Cairo districts recorded the highest gains in employment, while the highest rate of unemployment was recorded in Stan Creek. The only districts to have recorded decreases in employment were Corozal and Toledo. At the education level, primary school or less, education completed, over a half of the labor force are at that level. So our, our, our labor force is fairly uneducated labor force. So this, this is, to me, is, is, is a very interesting, interesting detail we have there. So the labor force has two parts, the, the employed and the unemployed. And so let's look at the employed, at the employed labor force. The employed labor force went up slightly from 2014, April 2014 to April 2015, went up by a total of about 3,000, 3,500, something like that people. Um, so the employed persons, 138,145 persons in April 2015. Employed persons, by the way, in our definition, are people who are economically active, who, have a, who, who work for one hour or more in the reference week. Of equal interest is the fact that within the Creole community, females are earning slightly more than men. The only areas that we have females making more than the males would be in the Creole, the Creole females make more than Creole males and uh, median salary, and also in, 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 a, in Stan Creek, that's the only other area. All the rest, basically males make a little bit more, $50, $60, $100 more than, than the females. Elsewhere in the presentation, external trade statistics for the first half of 2014 were also discussed. Belize imported goods totaling 1.2 billion, an increase of 50.3 million or 4.4 percent from the same period last year. Major contributors to the change in imports, we will see, 45 million less was spent on fuel, although importation of diesel, regular and premium increased. In the machinery and transport equipment category, we see it rises by 37 million due to increased purchases of sailboats, airplanes, vehicles, and telecommunication equipment. Imports destined to the commercial free zone, sorry, grew by 20 million. This is reflected in cigarette and clothing. Manufactured goods was up by 16.5 million, attributed to changes and an upward trend in the import of tires and steel. The chemical product purchases led to an almost 12 million rise in imports of fertilizers and medical supplies. Reporting for News 5, I am Isanik